young and impressionable. Second year journalism students get a taste of what they can expect when interviewing the president. One student pressed President Jacob Zuma about how the protection of state information bill will affect her future. The bill was criticized by many activists as an attempt to censor investigative reporting, as it will dish out hefty prison terms to journalists who disclose classified information, even if it's exposing wrongdoing. While the bill has come a long way since it was first sent to Parliament, its critics say it still doesn't offer enough safeguards for whistleblowers and journalists. But Zuma spoke a lot about personal privacy, instead of what the bill is intended to protect, national security. There are things that are not necessarily secret, but things that some of us don't like, uh, the manner in which people go into the personal things of people. Because the open society, is that right? Uh, some people who say it's absolutely correct, but some people who say there should be a limit. Zuma says some secrets are necessary. A state must have some secrets. There's no state that would not have secrets, otherwise it's not a state. Uh, how far do you go? Now, precisely because there has been no regulation of that. The government felt we should regulate it and make it known that, look, this is a line, this line you cannot cross. The argument is people to say we don't want any line. We want to cross and we want to report as far as we could. The controversial bill is currently with the president for assent. He says he's applying his mind to the piece of legislation before he signs it into law. Paula Charles, Parliament. News that moves. ENCA.com